Want to learn this effect? Film yourself holding up these items into the camera, then take close-ups holding those items. Bring your photos into Photoshop and remove the background so it's just your hand in the item. Import your videos and photos into Premiere. Move the first photo to the beginning of your clip when you hold the item up. Add the transform effect, scale it to match the size, keyframe scale, position, and rotation. Go to the middle, scale it up. Change the rotation 12 units from your initial keyframe, move forward three frames and increase another four units, and then move forward seven frames and decrease by four units. This gives it that natural sway effect. Go to where you want the item to zoom back out and copy and paste your initial keyframes. Add Gaussian blur to the video of you as well as the photo. Go two frames before the photo, keyframe, move seven frames forward and change to 86. Select your photo, keyframe 99 at the start, move five frames forward and change to zero. Go to where it starts to zoom out, keyframe zero again, move four frames forward and change to 99. Copy these attributes and paste them to each item shot. Then put them one after another and there you go. And don't forget, check out Mirror Camp and join our online school for more.